Hello guys, welcome to Filament Daily. Today will be the last third video in this mini-series talking about ERP SAS functions, the three gems that I found out, and the third one is this thing, suffix for the text input. It's not really a groundbreaking feature, you just define suffix for your text input, but what is really interesting and quite unique is that it is dynamic. So for example, you set for the invoice next number one, what if you change that to 13? and it changes to 13. Number digits, let's put three numbers, it changes to three. What about prefix? Let's change that to ABC and it changes here. So how to implement that one? And this is the source code. Invoice page, it's a custom page, it's not a resource page, but it has form with regular inputs and selects and other stuff. So this is the suffix, which also accepts a callback function. And that callback function has a get parameter with all the current values of the all current form fields, which includes get number prefix, get number digits, and state is the current value of the current number next text input, basically itself. So then we can dynamically construct the next available invoice number. For that, they use their own specific function of invoice model get number next with a lot of parameters. And we will not dive deeper what's inside of that. That doesn't really matter that much. What matters is the idea that you can dynamically construct the value of that suffix, which would automatically change on change of those number prefix, number digits, and number next. So yeah, quite a quick tip, but I thought it's pretty remarkable example and was worth the video. As usual, the source code will be in the description below as a link and subscribe to the channel to get more short and longer tips about filament on this channel. See you guys in other videos.